Alright. <clears throat> Good afternoon. <laughs> Good evening, guys. Welcome to this video. Today's Sunday, November 19th. It's currently 11.18 in the... Um, in the evening right now. So as you guys can tell from the title of the video, it is going to be a full day of eating video. I've been doing a ton of these lately and you guys have been enjoying them, so I'm gonna continue on hopefully doing a full day of eating video every single week for the rest of the year pretty much in like some sort of challenge video. I'm gonna try to do like a full day of eating with fast food, uh, full day of eating with like frozen food, all that kind of stuff. But today's just a normal one. I'm gonna put my macros either right here or right here on the screen for you guys. You guys can follow me along the entire day of what I'm gonna eat. Tomorrow's gonna be a very, very interesting day though because, well pretty much I'm leaving, or we're both leaving, Courtney's leaving as well. Uh, she's going back to Albuquerque for eight days tomorrow morning and then I was supposed to leave tomorrow morning but I actually booked a guest shoot tomorrow all day so I had to change my flight from the morning to the evening so I wake up my call times at 8 o'clock tomorrow for guests and then I work all day and then I'm off to the airport to head back to Portland for nine days for the holidays so it's pretty much gonna be like a travel full day of eating so it'll be very very interesting to see what I get into but before I get this video started we're doing a massive sale on both beyondlimitsathletics.com and on nickpelladino.com so Beyond Limits Athletics is my clothing line I'm going to be doing 50% off whatever inventory is remaining when this video goes up. Everything on the website is going to be 50% off for you guys. It's only going to be on there for probably another 5 to 6 days and then it'll go back to normal price. A lot of the stuff sold out, so whatever is remaining on my website, 50% off Black Friday sale. NickPaladino.com, that's my online coaching, fully custom plans. I'm doing 25% off any plan you want and this is going to involve a discount code so the discount code will be in the description down below with that being said guys i'm going to head off the bed i'm going to get six hours of sleep maybe and i'll see you guys bright and early for meal number one of this full day of eating video you guys won't see her the lighting's absolute so shit right awful. now you guys won't see her for another eight days so say bye happy thanksgiving guys she said, happy Thanksgiving. <laughs> and she started a YouTube channel. She did a Q&A video uh, on her YouTube channel, so be sure to check that out if you guys want to. Good morning, guys. Holy shit, I'm tired. Ugh. I literally just woke up, but 6.25 in the morning right now. I have to be out of here probably in about 30, 45 minutes to make it on time to my call time. You guys can tell Courtney already left. She went to the airport about 30 minutes ago, so I'm gonna go in the kitchen right now and cook up meal number one. It's gonna be a fairly small meal, something super fast that I can cook up real quick, and then I have to shower and get ready. Okay, so I think I'm actually gonna get into some of these right here. I had these a couple months ago and they were freaking delicious. So we're gonna do a couple servings of Power Cakes protein packed dark chocolate. Let me give you guys the macros. These are, the macros are fire. Four grams of fat, 28 carbs, and 14 grams of protein. Alrighty guys, so it is currently 7.15 in the morning right now. I need to get out of here probably within the next 5 to 10 minutes. Uh, I did want to show you guys what I'm eating 
for my breakfast though. So this is the dark chocolate power cakes. This is what two servings looks like. Two servings of egg whites in the batter and then a half a serving of almond milk as well. For those of you guys that are familiar with the power cakes or the recipe, it, requires, it calls for water and that's it. But if you guys want them a little bit fluffier, I suggest adding egg whites and egg whites just gives you a little bit more protein as well. So this meal right here is 445 calories, 38 protein, 56 carbs, and 9 grams of fat. And then right here, of course, a cup of black coffee, which I never track. Running a little bit late, so I decided to pack these pancakes to go and eat them on my way over to Guess. Pretty good though. Um, currently shooting at Guess right now. I'm on my lunch break, and the crew actually let me come over. They have these stand-in stores, like these kind of like prep stores, uh, to set up stuff for regular stores, like in all different kinds of malls and stuff. So this is kind of their setup. And check this out. <laughs> so you guys, these are some of the images that you guys will see in stores. There's your boy right there, me, another one of me. This one's dope. Woo, I had no idea they were in here. I'm gonna go look around, I haven't even seen some of the other images. Oh, there's more, that's so cool. Look at that. And then there's one more over here. Yeah, dope. Here's the other guest store. It's like a bunch of guest stores lined up. G by Guess, Guest Factory, the normal guests, and then Marciano's over there all lined up. And then the studio's actually in this building right over here. Man, that's so cool though. I'm gonna grab some lunch right now. These are all the snacks. So it's one o'clock right now. Came into the studio real quick to let you guys know what I'm eating. It's three servings of oatmeal, half a serving of protein powder, EVL birthday cake, and then one serving of almonds right here, which is about, I think, 500 calories in total. So I'm gonna eat this right now and uh, finish the rest of the shoot. Awesome day so far. So we got done super super early. It's 2 30 right now in the afternoon We didn't shoot e-com today, which is what I normally do on here We actually did like the email list and we're actually gonna be in a store window once again So this will be the second time I'm gonna be in the store window and this time the photos are gonna be up I think New Year's so like Christmas slash New Year time. I'm gonna have a massive window uh, of my picture up So I'm very very excited for that as well, but I gotta go Drop this bad boy off right here at the post office because uh, one of my uh, subscribers, oh no, this is the giveaway winner. The giveaway winner's package is right here. I'm shipping this off to Denmark, I believe. Got my meal right here that I had for lunch. This is what I had my pancakes on. A little bit of coffee that I had this morning. And we are headed home. I gotta pack. I gotta leave, head off to the airport. I think I probably have to leave around six o'clock, so I have about three and a half hours to cook probably one or two more meals to catch up on calories. I think I'm only about a thousand right now. And then I gotta pack everything up for nine days. So I just dropped off the package at the post office and I was looking for places to eat. There's a subway literally right next door to the post office, so I think I'm gonna try Subway. I haven't had Subway in years and years. I was never really a fan of it, but I've heard good things about it. I've heard that their meat quality and everything has gone up. I looked at their menu, everything looked really healthy. The macros were actually really, really solid. So I'm gonna go in there right now and order myself a foot long oven roasted 
no, 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 rotisserie chicken style sandwich, I guess. I don't really know what I'm gonna get on it yet, but they have a nutrition calculator online so I can calculate every single thing I get. Wish me luck, hopefully this meat is high quality. It's about 40 grams of protein, 40, 50 grams of protein almost for this meal right here, so let's go and do this. Can I get the uh, rotisserie style chicken foot long on wheat? I'm gonna do lettuce, bell peppers, banana peppers, onions, and then olives. And then uh, mustard and then vinegar. Got my subway, I'm headed home now. Here we go. It's 3.45 in the afternoon now. I'm about to eat meal number three for the day. This puts me at about, I think, 1,800 calories, which is about my halfway mark for the day. So I'm doing very, very well. I know I'm not gonna be able to eat a whole lot when I'm traveling on the flight and all that stuff. So I'm trying to get a bunch of calories in before then. So then uh, once I land in Portland, I probably just have to have one smaller meal and then I'm gonna head off to bed because I'm gonna be super tired tonight. I got about five hours of sleep last night. But I got a, I don't even know, rotisserie style chicken breast with mustard, vinegar, olives, onions, lettuce, and I think that is it. I didn't get any cheese on it. A lot of you guys already know that I'm very, very sensitive to dairy. It makes me break out, so I didn't get any cheese, which saved me a lot of fat as well. So this meal in total, or this foot-long sub, is 680 calories. We're looking at, let me just show you guys this. Subway did a very good job with customization on your macros. We're looking at 680 calories, 12 grams of fat, 87 grams of carbs, and then 57 grams of protein, which I'm not 100% sure if that protein's accurate because they didn't put a whole lot of chicken on there, so we're gonna probably underestimate a little bit just for the macro's sake, but I'm gonna enjoy this. I'm probably gonna sh uh, get all this makeup off my face, shower, take a small little nap, and then I have to start packing up. This place is a mess right now. I didn't have time to do the bed. We got pillows everywhere, some of Courtney's stuff. I have to pack for nine days. This is uh, this is what I'm working with. This is all my shirts right here. I don't have a whole lot of stuff. Got my jackets. I probably need to pack a few of these thick jackets because it's gonna be freezing up in Portland. These are all the shoes that I own right here. Bam, all this. I'm probably gonna pack a few of those, and uh, then we'll get going. It's 5.43 in the evening right now. I just woke up from, I think, like a 15-minute nap. I immediately started working on some client plans. I'm absolutely slammed with plans this week because I just fell a little bit behind. I have um, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. I have nine new clients, and a lot of these clients are about half of them, so about five of them are package plans, which means an ab, workout, and meal plan all in one. So I have about 25 to 30 total plans to do in the next four or five days, so that should keep me fairly busy right now. But I just looked at my phone, and I got a freaking email from Southwest Airlines saying my flight got delayed uh, one hour and 50 minutes. Ugh. I was like getting ready to go, I was about to cook my meal, head off to the airport, but now I have to wait another, I have probably about almost three hours until I have to go to the airport. The good thing about that is I have a lot of time to work on these plans, but the other thing is I don't want to get home at like two o'clock, which is what's going to end up happening here, so kind of just sucks, but I'm going to take a little break from the plans right now. I already knocked out one meal plan and one workout plan when I woke up. I'm going to go in the kitchen cook something up and show you guys what I'm gonna cook since it is a full day of eating video. I know I've been rambling on quite a bit today. So I was thinking about making some like healthy French toast with this bread right here and then some eggs. I know we got some cinnamon right here. I think we have vanilla too. Yeah, the girls were baking so they got some, some of this. So they got vanilla, I got this, the bread. I'm gonna use almond milk, dairy free, obviously, instead of regular milk. We're gonna do a couple eggs in that as well. And then with the French toast, this is gonna be a huge meal. I think it's gonna be like 1200 calories. With the French toast, I'm gonna be making eggs, egg whites, and then a bunch of russet potatoes on the side.
6.14 in the evening right now. I already started cooking my, what is this, my fourth meal for the day. I got the potatoes going. I did, oh shit, they're burning. Holy crap. No! Uh, Alright, let me take this out real quick. Okay, so I got the potatoes going. I'm doing one and a half pounds of potatoes in total, which is I think over, well over 100 grams of carbs. I ended up using the remaining part, or the remaining uh, bit of ground turkey, which actually conveniently ended up being exactly four ounces. So I have four ounces of Jenny O ground turkey in here. I'm gonna do the same thing that I did in one of my most recent full day of eating videos. I'm just gonna kinda uh, cook this up a little bit and throw it in my eggs. Three whole eggs. One serving of egg whites, I'm gonna put a little ground pepper in there. And then here is what I wanted to show you guys. We got the French toast batter or mix. And I decided, I kind of looked up a recipe. I did like just a splash of almond milk, uh, a couple dashes of cinnamon, a little teeny bit of vanilla extract in there. We have one whole egg and then we have one serving of egg whites right here. And here we are, we have a nice sized dinner. It's like a little breakfast, breakfast dinner I'd say. French toast, breakfast potatoes. We made a little burrito as well by the way. I added in, I found these in the fridge. These were Courtney's carb balance soft tortillas. Pretty decent macros, 19 carbs, five protein, and three grams of fat as well. So I already calculated this into my fitness pal as well. And I did put a teeny bit of syrup, you guys can tell. I did probably about one eighth of a serving of syrup on there, so I will track that. But I did want to give you guys my macros and the calories for this meal right here. So here's everything that is incorporated into this meal. The egg whites, russet potatoes, white Dave's Killer Bread, four whole eggs, Genio Turkey, and then the Carb Balance Tortilla. We're looking at 1,251 calories right here. I got everything packed up, guys. I got about an hour and a half to uh, head off to the airport, and I'll check in with you guys, most likely for my last meal for the day. I only got about four to 500 calories left, so I'll see you guys then. Hey. Good, how are you? Yeah. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Have a good one. May I have your attention, please? On behalf of the entire Southwest family, this session is like crew. This is the first flight made to Portland, Oregon. Please remain seated with your seatbelt fast and I'll let you carry it out of the stone until we arrive at the gate. The captain turns off that fast seatbelt sign. It's like one o'clock right now, just made it to the airport, so I'm gonna head home, which is like a 40 minute drive, and then I'm gonna have my last meal for the day. Uh, it's gonna be super easy, super quick, because I'm extremely exhausted right now, as you guys can probably tell. It's 2.30, let me get the exact time for you guys. It's 2.25 in the morning right now, I showered up, I'm now gonna have my last meal for the day. I'm so tired that I just whipped up a thing of cereal. You guys know, all you guys, all you long time subscribers that uh, watched me when I was bulking last year, this was my go-to post-workout meal. So it's been a very, very long time since I've had cereal, but it's just the easiest thing to do to hit my macros. And I hit them pretty spot on with this right here. So here is what we have going on. 218 grams of protein, a little bit low, 479 grams of carbs, and 81 grams of fat right here. My camera's about to die. That's gonna wrap up this full day of eating video, guys. I know it's probably an extremely long video, but I hope you guys enjoyed it nonetheless. It's always fun filming these full day of eating videos for you guys. I think I hit 30, around 3,500 calories today, which is pretty good. If you guys are interested in any of those sales, this is gonna be the biggest sale that I ever do uh, for Beyond Limits Athletics, my clothing line. So everything is already marked 50% off when this video goes up. And then on nickpalladino.com as well, the discount code for 25% off for my online coaching will be Black Friday 2017. All the information for both sales will be in the description down below for you guys. I'll probably see you in a few days. Happy Thanksgiving. I think this video is either going up on Thanksgiving or the day after. So I hope you guys enjoyed it with your family. Peace out.